Michelle Young fell in love on reality television twice on both The Bachelor season 25 and The Bachelorette season 18, and now she reveals if she would ever look for romance on another dating show. Michelle was the runner-up on Matt James' season of The Bachelor, but he chose Rachel Kirkinell for his final rose recipient. Michelle became the lead of The Bachelorette season 18 a few months later. Michelle, a 28-year-old elementary school teacher from Minnesota, was a different kind of bachelorette. She was soft-spoken and sophisticated. Rather than engaging in drama with the men, she had a knack for diffusing it, which many attributed to her career as a teacher. Many of the men on her season fell in love with her because of her empathy and kindness, including her eventual fiancé Nate Olukoya, runner-up Brandon Jones, and Final Four contestant Rodney Matthews. Michelle felt an instant spark with Nate, a 27-year-old sales executive originally from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Bachelorette Michelle gave him her first impression rose and first kiss of the season. Initially, they appeared to be two very different people, but they built a strong connection. Although some people warned Michelle about Nate's so-called red flags, she believed in him. In the end, he proposed, and they made history as the first couple of color to get engaged on The Bachelorette. However, they decided to go their separate ways a few months later. In an interview with The Page Six, Michelle laughed as she revealed that, although she wants say never, it is unlikely that she will ever look for love on reality television again. The former Bachelorette shared, I am really wanting to spend more time with someone to get to know him fully before committing. The shows don't set you up for that. After falling in love on two shows that encourage whirlwind romances, Michelle knows what she wants in a relationship. Although Michelle's relationship with Nate is now over, she admitted, I'm glad I gave it a shot. It didn't end how I wanted it to, but I did find love. She said that because she is going through a breakup and heartbreak, she is taking the summer for herself, and also not dating at the moment. Michelle also explained more about her recent announcement that she is taking a break from teaching saying, I'm taking a leave of absence next year to make sure that I'm taking care of myself. I need a second. During her time in Bachelor Nation, Michelle put her heart on the line twice in a very public way, so it is understandable that she does not have any upcoming plans to do it again. However, one never knows what the future might bring. Becca Kuprin, Michelle's Bachelor Happy Hour podcast co-host, had the same experiences on The Bachelor and The Bachelorette, and she eventually appeared on Bachelor in Paradise, where she met her fiancé, Thomas Jacobs. Although Michelle is hesitant now, she knows that finding love on reality TV again isn't impossible. The Bachelorette airs Mondays at 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Saving Time on ABC. Source, page 6.